Only love will go to the past. The others, whether the verb is mudarya or whether the verb is madi, eh? the mudarya, of course, relates to present and future. But if it is madi, with these instruments of shart, the translation will be present and future. So, can you see the second one? Imma madi yaini. They can be both madi. How will you translate? In present tense. Huh? Sister Hafsa? Sister uh, Mahanas? You will translate in present tense. Huh? So, it's, do not get confused, brother. Huh? Inshallah, you will see the sentence and you will figure out. Number third. Himma madiyan. The madiyan has come first. That means the fellow shart can be madi. Are you with me? Vafa mudariya. And that means the jawabu shart is mudariya. Not that, yeah. Okay. I go back to number two. Imma madiyani. If they are both madi, how will you describe them? Fi mahali jasmin. Are you with me? Fi mahali jasmin. Very good. Now, in the third, imma madiyan. Then you will say, fi mahali jasmin. Fa mudariyan. And that will be majzum. See here, man kana yuridu harth al-akhirati. Who, if so ever wants the, the, the harvest in the akhira. Okay? You want to do good deeds. And you tell Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that I'm doing this to please you. Huh? Okay? Because I want my akhira to be, to be better. You know, dunya, alhamdulillah, whatever you give me, alhamdulillah, I'm grateful to you, but I want the akhira to be better. So, if we desire akhira, Allah will increase it. Our benefits in akhira. So look at it. Man kana yuridu harth al akhirati nazid lahu nazid zada yazidu. Are you with me? Zada yazidu. Five in your pocket. Yazidu, tazidu, tazidu, azidu, nazidu. Make it majzum. Nazid. Huh? Where is the file? Mustatir. Takdiruhu nahnu. And where does Nahnu, nahnu go to? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Nadid lahu fi harfihi. Are you with me? So, first was kana. What was the first verb? Kana. Mahdi. And then nazid mudariya. Huh? So, kana will be fi mahali jasmine. And nazid is normal. Majzum. Wa huh? imma. Mudarian, first it will be Mudarya, eh? for Mahdiyan, and then it will be Mahdi. Eh? This is a hadith. Kawalu Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, brothers and sisters. Man yakum, yakum, see? Kama yakumu, it became yakum. Whosoever stands or prays, Establishes Laylatul Qadri, huh? brothers and sisters. Laylatul Qadri, huh? Imanan, wa ihtisaban. Whosoever prays, stands up and prays huh? with faith, with the desire to please Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Okay. Uh, brother and sister, ihtasaba is to ask for khair from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Uh, ihtasaba means in the lahi khairan. In the lahi khairan. Uh, that we desire from Allah, with Allah, khair, inshallah. Uh, uh, in other words, we seek Allah's pleasure. Huh? Seeking Allah's pleasure. Anticipating Allah's pleasure. Huh? 
When you pray, you stand up and you pray, you hope for Allah's pleasure. You anticipate His pleasure and mercy and grace. Huh? Okay, brothers and sisters? So, go fear Allah. Yeah? Allah forgives him. He is forgiven. Are you with me? So, Gufira is Mahdi. And Yaqum is Mudariya. So, that is also possible. Bahada Kalilun. But this is not often. It is rare. Now, what is the gist of all this, brother? The gist is this. That in the Jawabu Shart, and in the Shart, with Fialu Shart, let me phrase it in a different way. If the Fialu Shart and Jawabu Shart, if they are Mudariya, they will be Majizum. Otherwise, if they are Mahdi, what will you say? Fi Mahali Jasmine. That's all, brother. That's all. So whenever Shart will come, we are going to look for Fialu Shart, and Jawabu Shart. If the Fialu Shart and Jawabu Shart are Majizum in its natural state, fine. They are good, brother. If they are Mahdi, then we'll say Fi Mahali Jasmine. So you will be watching this, huh? inshallah. Now, brothers and sisters, we come to the exercises. They are very simple, very interesting. I should say they are Halwa Puri. They are very, very uh, easy and enjoyable. Huh? Okay. Fi kulli fitratin. What is the meaning of fitratin? Part or section. Huh? Part or section. Hmm? Or even you can say passage. Fi kulli fitratin mimma yati jumlatani. There are two sentences. Eh? al make fi'al al-ula shartan. Make the first verb as a fi'al shart. Wa fi'al al-ukhra jawabuhu. And the other one, jawabuhu. Musta' milan. Means using. What will you use? In. So all the exercises are in. Now we are going to do it quickly. Huh? I request you that during the weekend, please write it. This lesson should be written. All the exercises should be written. Then inshallah you will become very strong. Huh? Then we, when we study Quran, you will be able to enjoy it. And, and taste the eloquence yeah. and the magic and the sweetness of the words of Quran. Tadribuni adribuka. Sister Abza? In? In tadribni. Khalas, but it's so simple. In tadribni adribka. Khalas? Adribka. Are the two fields in its normal state of majizum? Yes, khalas. They are both majizum. Huh? So one is fialushat, the other is Jawabu Shat. Got the idea? And you can describe it. Okay. In Harfu Shat, Jazimun, Tajizimu, Fialaini. You will always say like that. Huh? And then you will say, Tadrib, Fialun Mudariun, Majizumun Bisikun. And it is your Fialu Shat. File, Mustatir, Takdiruhu Anta. What is noon? Noon vikaya. Noon of protection. It protects the verb. Huh? Because if there was no noon, then the ya mutakalam will give kasara to the verb. And then the verb will be ruined. Huh? Huh? Because verb cannot have a kasara at the end. Okay. 